We are learning some new information this morning about the electronic scooters or electric scooters that really took the Queen City by storm. They arrived on Wednesday, but today they're reportedly being pulled from the streets. That's because the company, Lime Bike, apparently didn't get the proper approval before bringing all these scooters to town. NBC Charlotte's Ariel Placencia live in South End this morning. So, Ariel, some reports say the scooters have to be gone by today, but now we're learning maybe not. You're learning firsthand, maybe not. Yeah, it seems like it's a little ambiguous, and I say that because I got a chance to talk to a line bike worker this morning. Basically, he pulled up in a van, and I thought he was coming to take these four scooters away, but I watched him get out, inspect each one of these, recharge them, and then I said, hey, are you taking these away? Don't they have to be off the streets by the end of the day today? He just looked at me and said, no comment. But I'll tell you who is commenting this morning, and that's Charlotte City Council. The scooters by Lime Bike debuted three days ago, but today they'll reportedly be gone from the streets. Charlotte City Councilman Tariq Scott Bokari taking to Facebook, saying Lime Bike didn't play by the rules and follow the pilot permit protocol. But he writes that he is supportive of these, quote, very cool scooters. In fact, in another post, Bokari says that a second scooter sharing company called Bird has reached out and is interested in bringing their product to the Queen City. Bird is based out of California and is similar to Limebike. Meanwhile, Limebike issued the following statement to NBC Charlotte, saying in part, We have and will continue to work collaboratively with the city toward a common sense regulatory solution that prioritizes rider safety and accessibility while maintaining our scooters as an affordable transportation alternative for residents of Charlotte. And if you want to read the rest of that statement, head over to our website. That's WCNC.com. So we'll just have to wait and see how much longer these guys stick around. We'll have to see if maybe limes turn to birds. If a new company comes in, we'll, of course, keep you posted. But Ben and Carolyn, I went on the app this morning, and I could only count eight scooters in the Queen City. So not many of them left if you wanted to try and ride them. My wow. friend, Charlotte. I'm Ariel Placencia. I'll send it back to you in the studio. But those ones seem to be charged where Ariel is. Yeah, so. interesting. All right.